Hello, good evening. Welcome everybody on tonight's call. My name is Claudia Eifert uh, and I have with me here the founder and CEO of Utopian Global on the call, Bill Raul. Bill, uh, how is Dubai? How are you? Lovely to see you tonight. Hi Claudia, it's always great to be here and uh, great to be joining our members from various parts of the world. So uh, thank you for making the time to joining us. That is so true. I mean, we have people coming on board from many, many places, many new names I don't know. So um, it's great to see uh, always uh, different names and of course from different countries. Uh, that is fantastic. We have, I believe, uh, many places in Europe, uh, Latin America. We have people from the US, Canada. Great to have you on the call. Um, uh, and Africa and Asia. So uh, it must be really early morning if you're getting up in Australasia and New Zealand. So fantastic to uh, do that um, and welcome to all of you. And of course, we have all our people who are uh, chatting us already and saying hello. Hello, Sahir. Hello, Robbie. Great to have you uh, on the call as well here. So you see, I have a little chat box. If you have any questions, um, I'm going to walk you through the presentation together. And then we're going to have um, a little bit of an interaction with, of course, our CEO uh, of Utopian Global doing some Q&A. So you can, in your chat box, type in your questions you do have um, and you are very welcome to do so. Now, I'm going to start the presentation now um, and going to walk you through about Utopian Global, what Utopian Global is. Um, and uh, if uh, this could be something uh, for you, I believe it is, um, because uh, especially right now in these times, uh, which we are experiencing uh, in a very, very changing world, uh, we, I believe, need what Utopian Global is having or giving us. So with that, I'm going to start um, the presentation. So for all you listeners who come on board right now and uh, maybe miss uh, the, the beginning, uh, you will always have it as a replay later on our YouTube channel. So uh, with that quick introduction um, as well to myself, so I'm going to be the host here tonight. I'm with the company uh, around almost 13 years. Um, and Bill was, of course, the one who introduced me to Utopian Global. He shared with me the vision of what he wanted to do when he established this company. Um, and for me, I, back in that time, I was working very, very hard managing. In the morning, I was a manager in a large company. And in the evening, I was managing a, a one-star Michelin restaurant um, in Germany, uh, always looking for ways to make more income, not really realizing that I was in the trap or in that red race, what they call. Um, and really through Utopian Global and through Bill, his knowledge and the people he introduced me, uh, I could eventually quit my jobs um, and be really full time uh, working on my dream instead of always working on other people's dream. Uh, so if uh, this is what you're looking for, then you got to listen really carefully. So Utopian Global, real lifestyle and real income, real assets. Now, what are some of the challenges most people do actually face today? No money, no savings, live paycheck to paycheck. Believe me, I was there. High student loans, personal credit card debt, I mean, is surpassing now one trillion. Many, many people have a lot of credit card debt. In fact, they're not even paying any more back, uh, which, which is the debt they're picking, paying back the interest. Um, so artificial intelligence also is a huge uh, factor to consider. We'll automate uh, in the next um, 15 years, 40% of the jobs, they will be not anymore there. Now, if you don't believe it, uh, search this article. That is an article from Forbes. Uh, so this is certainly a case. 85% of people, they're unhappy and unfulfilled at their work. They don't really like what they are doing, um, but yet, of course, they do it. So if you ever felt like you were actually meant for more, that is actually what I did feel. I, I felt I was meant for more. Uh, was this my life working so hard, uh, always in that red race, never have time freedom? Well, if you feel that you were meant for more, then this presentation is for you. Because how would it feel if you had really control of every aspect of your life? What if there was a way to actually build a better life? Um, a life where you experience more happiness, more fulfillment. Well, with Utopian Global, you now have the power to instantly build and grow real wealth. Build 
and grow real wealth through an easy platform that protects everyone's future with a medium of exchange that really has stood the test of time, which is of course silver and gold. Um, and a platform where you can earn residual rewards from real income producing assets. Um, built by a community that believes you should have control of your money, not the money uh, being in control of you. A global community that's working together to restore value in money, founded by the belief that everyone should experience financial freedom, no matter who you are, where you live and what you earn, no matter what religion you have, not matter what race, it doesn't matter. Uh, Utopian Global is certainly a company driven by three pillars. One is trust, second is freedom, and the third is community. Without the community, we would not be here today. Without the community, we would have not achieved what we have achieved for so many people. We're all about helping your money working for you instead of you working for it. You see, that is the big difference. And this is the big difference in the four ways money is actually being created. Now, 95% uh, of the people, unfortunately, they only share in 5% of the wealth. So all the wealth which is created, 95% only share in 5%. 5% of the people make 95% of the wealth. They share in 95% of the wealth, only 5%, the business owners and the investors. Now, 60% of the people work for someone. They, as I always say, you know, they work building somebody else's dream. They're trading their time for money, for a currency which is losing value over time. They're basically in, in the trap. Uh, if they are not working, of course, they get not, no pay. And the same is, of course, for the uh, person who works for himself. They own their own business, a small business, maybe a small shop, maybe a lawyer, maybe you are a doctor even, um, and uh, you are self-employed. Well, you go on vacation, you're not getting paid. Well, you go um, and you're, or you are sick, you're not getting paid because you have downturn in your job. Uh, so 35% work for themselves, trading also just like the 60% time for money, for a currency which is losing value. And the problem with that is you are trading your time and your time is valuable. We all have only the same hours. Um, so a business owner, this is where uh, really money wealth is created. Why? Because you now apply what we call leverage leverage so instead of having you putting all your effort in you have a business you have a vehicle you have a team of people so you rather uh, as john paul getty said have um, one percent of the efforts of a hundred people than a hundred percent of your own effort this is where wealth is created when you join utopian global you automatically become part of that four percent and of course one percent the investor is where money now works for you we are all about having money working for you instead you working for it you see one percent of the investor well what is it you could be a real estate of course owner renting out that is passive income well with us through our um, income producing assets you automatically become in the category of the one per center. And of course, uh, the gold and silver, which is your hedge against inflation, your insurance policy, and at times like these, it can be also a great um, investment. Um, so Utopian Global, real assets, real income, real lifestyle, gold or silver, this is our foundation, this is our core product, um, and this is really what why Bill founded this company so long ago, to help you, no matter where you come from, no matter what uh, you have to have access to it from as little as 25 euro, be able to diversify your money, which is losing value over time into precious metals, which over time um, never loses value. A store obviously is our income producing assets. It's a platform, it's a, uh, it's a crowdfunding platform. In fact, Store is a company in itself. We promote it, we market it, we raise funds for it. Uh, Store stands for Sustainable Technology and Resource Holding, uh, which of course through the crowdfunding, Store then buys assets which do produce income. And that is, of course, uh, what is money working for you. Um, education, well, again, for me, it all started with the education, the knowledge, 
I did not gather from school, I did not gather from university, uh, and that is of course uh, the knowledge about what money is and how money works, because uh, unfortunately this is not taught anymore. I mean, people look sometimes with square eyes to me when I talk to them about gold or silver, they really don't get it, they think it's a jewelry, they think, well, they uh, buy a nice ring uh, when they get married, um, but they don't really understand what it means in the financial terms, what it means as a prof in your portfolio, what it really means as your inheritance. Um, so this all well, you're going to learn through our education platform on top of it of course from our coaches uh, you're going to learn about um, how you master your mind um, because especially in these times you've got to be very strong you've got to be have a very strong mindset to not get of course in the doom and gloom with this pandemic coming going on and of course we do have a platform that you can become your own boss. Now, this is not for everybody, but if you have a bigger goal, if you have a bigger dream, if you don't want to just build somebody else's dream, then become your own boss. We have the platform for you to do so. We have the marketing tools. We give everything to you in a box. All what you're going to do is um, you apply what you learn and you share the message and you make money. Now, going back very quickly to gold, Gold has outperformed all major fiat currencies over time. We have people here on the call today from Nigeria. We have people from South Africa on the call. We have people from Ghana on the call, uh, US, um, Canada, uh, Australia. Uh, where else? Um, let me just check here. Uh, Pakistan. Um, we have people from Dubai, of course, on the call. So from many, many places. Well, check that. Every currency over time has lost their value against gold. Gold outperforms everything. Do your own gold. How much gold do you have? Why do all the billionaires, why do central banks buy gold? Why do they have part of their portfolio in gold? Well, because they are smart. How much gold do you own? That is my question to you. You see, when we just look at the performance in the United States dollar, well, the last 20 years, had you just held onto a US dollar, um, of course, uh, your gold would have outdone the US dollar 537%. Um, so you, meaning you would have lost. Your uh, dollar buys you way less uh, right now, over 537% less. You go, your dollar purchase you today, in, uh, of course, against gold or silver. So what we do is we make gold or silver savings easy. Very simple. This is how we started our platform so many years ago. Um, and we even have a way to show you how to get paid to save in gold and silver. Now, uh, Utopian Global uniquely integrates physical gold and silver into the digital world. You save in investment grade gold and silver. You can buy it, you can sell it, and you can store it. Enjoy the lowest gold and silver prices and our affordable fees for our customer. I mean, we, we sell the gold at the lowest prices. And you can redeem physical silver and gold. And you legally own it. You are the legal owner of it. And you can have it shipped to you from as little as one gram, of course, to the countries where we can ensure um, and secure your shipment. Easy platform, 24-7 access, easy liquidation. LBMA London Bullion Market Associated Good Delivery, Secure Private London Bullion Market Associated Vaulting with Loomis International. If you see the money tracks, and especially in different cities as well in the US, but also in Europe, you see um, uh, those tracks, which are the tracks, um, and very often they have the symbol of Loomis. Well, this is the company which we store with. Uh, we source the gold from the number one refinery in the world, which does the Rolex watches, the Philip Patik watches, or the Horias. And we have, of course, auditing. So this is the Loomis sign, as you see here, uh, from those tracks, which actually store. This is the storage facility in Dubai, as well as in Switzerland. And Argo is the, um, uh, this is the, um, uh, of course, refinery. So we have fully secured gold and silver because you deserve free, transparent, and unlimited access to your assets. Store the great, amazing asset equity platform. Earn from our income producing assets via the store platform. How does it work? Very simple. The network through Utopian Global generates the income. Store uh, then acquires the assets. 
the assets then are sold to the markets, the assets generate income, and of course, the storeholders receive cash, uh, cash flow. Now, stores not available in the United States, unfortunately, um, but it's great other products in the United States um, available. Um, so, a store currently, because of the asset which we do own, which is the Texas oil producing field, um, uh, produces roughly 20% or returns roughly 20% per annum. It's, um, as I said, in Texas, it's an oil field, which is already in production 80 years. I have been there various times now. Um, and it has a, a 25 plus years proven reserves in that meaning still for 25 years it's going to produce and pump oil. Um, now why oil? Because uh, we went into oil and gas because of the relationship of Bill Raul, our CEO, our founder with Ryan Messer and because it is a very stable, very long-term asset and of course we need oil in everything, in all our day. In fact, 80 products on a daily basis, which we come in contact with, um, are derived from oil. And so even though we are very much want to go into um, alternative resources, uh, etc., well, still oil and gas is very, very important. So next week, we're going to have a call with Ryan Messer and Bill Raul about, of course, uh, uh, raccoon band about this oil field, about our cash payouts, which soon are going to start because we own that asset only since less than one year because the platform store is pretty, pretty new. Now, store the uh, platform, the project timeline for it. Um, we started, uh, as I said, it's a very young project. We only started at the end of 2018. Uh, we started raising funds, didn't have any assets, purchased the first small asset in March 2019. Uh, and then, of course, in August 2019, we purchased the Raccoon Band oil field. We own a percentage of that, 12%. And, of course, that is producing cash flow. Um, now, then we reinvest since then into it to drill more, to make more holes, to repair others. And uh, of course, very soon, we're going to start to see some payouts. And with that, of course, we are not done with store. We're looking for uh, adding more and more and more assets that we eventually launch on an exchange. So you can multiply literally um, your money if we do, of course, launch on an exchange with that Price. Now, understand, of course, it's always a disclaimer, uh, timeline, etc. Uh, various uh, things you have to consider. But what we do have is we own a asset that is producing currently uh, cash flow. No matter the uh, oil prices, Bill, maybe we'll touch on it a little bit later because we have an insurance policy with British Petroleum. Now, Bill Rall, he is the founder and CEO of Utopian Global here, actually holding on to a Pretty nice size gold bar um, in the refinery in Switzerland. Um, and uh, Ryan Messer, he is the CEO of Utopia of, of a store uh, and uh, the Utopian Global founder, Bill Raul. Because of his long partnership, friendship, um, investments they did together, uh, the, they, he, they came up basically with the idea to uh, build a project for the network um, so that you guys have cash flow and uh, this is really amazing and of course the team uh, of experts in all their areas uh, have around 250 years of combined expertise they own either they all either run their own companies or of course are uh, involved in huge giant companies um, so if all what you saw right now you like so far i hope you do um the, you have the question well claudia okay i get it how can i get started well, uh, very simple. Most people join as a customer. Uh, they, uh, of course, want to have gold and silver. Why? Because they want to have an insurance policy in heritage for their children's children. They can do so from as little as 25 euro, buy gold and silver. They can buy as much as they want. 25 is the minimum. If you want to put in a thousand, if you want to put in a million, you can do so. Um, uh, that is all, of course, up to you. You want to buy a store, uh, you're outside the United States because you want to own real assets which produce uh, great income. Well, then, of course, store is uh, for you um, and you can get in from as little as 50 euro. And again, there is no limit to what you can come in to. Um, the store obviously going to earn from the increase in the asset value and the distributions. Or 
you want what I did and I, what I wanted to become. I wanted to be my own boss. I didn't want to uh, any more work on anybody else's dream. I wanted to have freedom, the freedom to wake up when I finish sleeping, the freedom uh, that I didn't need to choose in the menu on the left side, but I rather choose on the on the right side, the freedom that I could actually um, do charity when I wanted, that I wanted to travel when where I wanted without thinking to how much money does it cost me now to travel? Can I afford to travel? An affiliate, this is what I choose to become my own boss. I selected my affiliate package um, and committed to a 50 euro monthly asset accumulation plan. When you join this business, you join this business, you select your package 30 days after you uh, 50 euro monthly asset accumulation plan starts. If you're in the United States, you get gold. If you're outside, you get store. And as it says, it's accumulating assets over time. Um, you then can, of course, earn from all your customer sales you do, your affiliate sales, um, and uh, you get a platform for, of course, uh, where you have your gold, silver, precious metals as wholesale price. 3%. There's no buyback fee if you want to, uh, or sell back fee when you want to sell it back. There is storage. Storage is for free. Now, any other platform, it doesn't matter where you go, you, I can assure you, you have fees for storing your gold if you have it physical. And we have physical gold here. We don't believe in paper. Um, oh, you get your marketing platform, sales funnel, your daily, weekly, monthly referral, referral income, your premium education, and coaching programs. Only days programs is tens and more of tens of thousands of dollars on value. And I know that because I paid for it, <laughs> um, because we didn't have them when I started my coaching programs. Um, so I actually paid for it. And yes, um, that was a lot of money. You get that all involved in your package. Now, you have different packages to start. The first two, they are for Africa and Latin America, um, and a smaller, smaller entry into the business platform. But for them, of course, this is a lot of money in these countries. Uh, Europe, America, we start with 390 and uh, uh, higher. Why? Because we just get more assets. Um, we get more for our money. And of course, uh, you know, $99 uh, dollars or euros or whatsoever in Europe, is not really that great of a deal. Uh, so uh, then we have all other packages for investors. They start from 9,000 euro up to 1 million. And again, you just get simply more assets. Um, in the US, all the packages are replaced by gold and by silver. So uh, all what you see here in the small print is actually your gold and silver you're gonna get. Um, and as you learned from me in earlier in the presentation, over time, it outdoes any currency, no matter where you're from. So there's multiple ways to earn if you decide to become your own boss. And we do what, of course, anybody anyhow does. We share. Uh, so we share uh, the message and we're getting paid for sharing the message. Now, everybody on a daily basis sharing products and services. You just don't get paid for. And that is the reality. Uh, uh, so I was just on a call earlier with um, Sahir and he was eating his uh, beautiful veggie burger there and it looked pretty yummy. So he basically was selling the pretty the good uh, burger shop where he had this really uh, great burger from where he just doesn't get paid. He doesn't get paid uh, for it um, from that burger shop to get eat his uh, burger for free the next time or for bringing people uh, to this shop. So here you're going to get paid for bringing people um, sharing that message. Um, this is what we do and this is why you earn multiple uh, ways fast start commissions, direct bonuses every time somebody buys gold or silver from you, 5% from all the customers, uh, you bring 1% from your affiliates. Um, and you have all kinds of incentives from uh, smartphone to laptop to um, uh, even land ownership if you are in Uganda or in Kenya um, to many other uh, great incentives. Um, and how we would like to um, encourage you, of course, when you, when you start your business, with the, the system we're working with is very simple. The power of free, find free others who also like what you saw 
and basically your package is paid for, your entry is paid for, your business system, your vehicle is paid for, and you own your assets. Now, you can even do that with one person. Let's say you came in with 99 euro um, and you have somebody coming in with 1,500. Well, now you already made a commission of 500 euro, but your package was only 99 pretty amazing uh, actually pretty pretty great and we have people doing that i mean i was just this morning with a call and pastor eddie uh, from uganda uh, in his first month now for him 99 euros something like a year's pay or so um well he did bring somebody on board uh from a foreign country um and he straight away uh made that commission i believe he made his first month 1500 euro now this in uganda is a lot of money not a lot here in europe Okay. But so it doesn't matter where you come from. That is why I'm saying that. Now, the great thing is you can actually get your asset accumulation plan for free. Now, since I started 13 years ago, I never paid for my asset accumulation plan. Why? I used the commission from sharing, which I'm doing on a daily basis. And I used that commission to pay to offset my monthly and, of course, even to accumulate more um, gold or silver and store. But as simple as referring one person, one person a month, your monthly asset accumulation plan is actually offset um, because your commission or your bonus will be covered the plan. So for less than one euro a day, you have available an opportunity that you can have ownership in real income producing assets, wealth protection, a a savings accumulation plan denominated in real assets, a global online business, residual income, an independent team working for you and with you for free, and you can even enjoy tax, uh, tax uh, breaks. So if you are looking for pay up your debt, save money, change lives, create generational wealth, then this is for you. Your time to build wealth with passive income starts today. And important notice, at the end of this presentation, the Utopian Global Compensation Plan is an exciting opportunity, I can tell you that. That rewards you if you become a business owner for selling the services and for sponsoring participants who do the same. Although the opportunity is unlimited, individual results will vary depending on your commitment levels and sales skills of each participant. Nowadays, income projections should not be considered as guarantees or projections of your actual earnings and profits, success with Utopian Global results from hard work, from dedication, leadership. If you don't share it and you come on the business, well, you're not getting paid from sharing. You're going to have your gold or silver, you're going to get your store, um, but um, you're not going to pay from sharing it if you don't share it. As per terms of conditions, store equity is not license for distribution in the United States. As a result, may not be offered, sold or delivered there. And we have a 14 days money back guarantee. So now you can do two things. You can either go back to the person who referred you to this presentation or ask us more questions um, or of course, get started. Uh, get started right now, because at the end of the day, um, you know, what uh, are you going to uh, do? Uh, this is the question I have to ask you. What are you going to do? Are you going to um, keep doing the same things over and over? I believe um, uh, Einstein said it's a question of insanity. Or do you want to change your life? Do you want to have a better life? Um, so it is up to you. You decide. Um, and um, uh, with that, I want to now hand over to our founder and CEO of Utopian Global. I want to look at uh, if we do have some questions here. And please ask questions. This is why we do this webinar, so that you get all your answers covered. So with that, thank you, guys. Um, and I appreciate you listening to me. Bill, uh, do you have anything you would like to add, which I have not covered before I go into questions? Well, Claudia, I think you covered it exceptionally well. But, um, you know, one thing I will say, uh, first of all, I congratulate you, persistence for 12 years. But the smart thing about this whole concept of doing it for 12 years is you haven't waited for a pandemic to, be, to begin to be a saver. You've been saving for 12 years. You've been converting your commissions. You've been taking paper wealth, converting it into real assets for the last 12 years, month after month, price averaging it. Very, very smart. So, Times like now, when most people are caught without savings or only two or three paychecks away from being broke, you're in a situation, you're in, I won't say a lucky situation, you're in a fortunate situation because you created this situation yourself by being on a plan, by having a plan. 
you dedicated yourself to generating another source of income and you took part of that income, part of this paper wealth which you explained very clearly, loses purchasing power and you put it into a real asset savings program in the form of gold and silver. And now, of course, we have the, the uh, natural resource asset uh, just outside of Houston, uh, which will start paying out distributions uh, in the Q3, Q3, which is starting next month, of course. Uh, so that's going to be very, very, very exciting. The challenge is most people don't understand gold. So let me give you a couple of examples why you're building wealth preservation. If you look at America, the average price of a US home in 1971, the medium sized home was $25,000. That same medium sized home today is about $280,000. Now, in 1971, you needed $25,000 to buy the house or you needed about 700 ounces of gold. Now today, you don't need $25,000 to buy the same house, you need actually $280,000, but the difference is you only need about 160 ounces of gold at current prices. See, it's not about the gold price, it's what the unit of value, it's what it can buy for you, whether it's barrels of oil, whether it's property, whether it's um, other real tangible assets, That's it's a unit of value, that's what gold is. If you look at Britain, the average price of a house in London in 1971, was about um, 5,000 pounds. Now today, I believe it's about uh, just under half a million pounds. Huge difference. Now the gold price in 1971 in pounds, I think was around 14 pounds. Actually, that's the price of what silver is now roughly uh, in the UK. But now, of course, uh, the price of gold in the UK in pounds is roughly $1,400. So 1,400 pounds, sorry. So that's a hundred fold. So if you wanted to buy, the point I'm making is you need about you needed about 140 to 150 ounces of gold to buy the house back in uh, in London in 1971. You need the same amount of gold to do it today, about 145 uh, ounces of gold to buy the same medium-sized house, say half a million uh, pounds uh, today. Again, it's wealth preservation. It's a store of value, but you need a lot more pounds. Back then it was 5,000 pounds. Now you need nearly half a million pounds significant difference so the the point here is is that being able to when you exchange your labor for an income regardless of what that paper currency is take part of that out and put it into an automatic savings program it doesn't matter how much it is it could be 25 euros per month less than a couple of dollars a day but month after month year after year you're building a storehouse of real wealth and you just never know when you may need it look what's happened in the last months in the world now we would never have known that global markets have contracted so much. We would have never have known that tens of millions of jobs globally have been lost. None of us, well, Matt, some of us were prepared for this because some of us have knowledge and we are savers. But in the consumption world that we live in, where people live from credit cards today, that live beyond their means, people were not pre prepared for this. And if they didn't have government assistance, they'd be in, they'd be in a, a lot, a lot of trouble. I think there's something like, uh, 30 million people on assistance in the US uh, just for food vouchers and different things like that. Pretty substantial in one sense. So the whole idea about Utopian Global, it's a very simple concept. You get engaged, it's very cost effective. It, it doesn't have to put anyone into financial risk. Less than a couple of dollars a day, less than a cup of coffee a day or a cup of tea a day if you're in Britain. Um, and you're getting ownership of a global business. You're getting ownership of real assets. And when you share it with other people, you're gonna earn another you're going to earn currency and then you can take those currency pay some of your bills down pay off your bills reduce your debt and of course also saving a bit of gold and silver or get involved uh, with, with some of our natural resource assets that we actually own that's really the message of utopian global but don't wait for a pandemic to start you've got to train your mind to start doing it now month after month after month do it build wealth it takes time and it's you're building wealth for the next generation but it's your, but in your time, it's your, it's your insurance policy. That's really the key, uh, the key to this. So that's why I love this whole concept. This is why we founded it. And even though the world is in turmoil right now, if you are prepared and you have knowledge and understanding, you can take this crisis and turn it into an awesome opportunity. And that's exactly what we're doing. And I don't yeah. mean that we're taking advantage of other people. I just mean that if you're prepared, you can go through these challenging times with people who are ill-prepared, obviously uh, they find it very, very challenging and uh, we wanna be prepared. 
Absolutely, that's what um, Eric Hoffer didn't he say uh, uh, that uh, so well and so nicely. Now, um, uh, Mac uh, is asking a question here. He says, "Very good explanation. Thank you so much." Um, uh, if I was to invest a large amount, then would the return be quicker and greater? In what gold or silver or store? That I don't know. Uh, but uh, so, Mac, let's, let's, touch, let's in, touch on all of them then, mm -hmm. if, because, mm -hmm. because it's not a bad question. Okay, first of all, the point I want to make is it's all about risk management. No one should be putting themselves in a financial position or the family in a financial position to cause stress and disharmony. Okay, so we have a concept there that allows all people to be engaged. Uh, and I believe the best way to be involved, I love the affiliate program because it costs less than $2 a, a, a day. You get ownership of real assets and through sharing it with other people, you can actually generate another income and convert that into your own assets. But let's just say you wanted to put X amount of uh, dollars or euros into, into gold and silver. I think long term, it's a fantastic investment. Why do I say that? I believe that given that the, I think uh, US just this year alone has, has uh, printed the Federal Reserve has uh, expanded the monetary supply by about 3.7 trillion um, uh, dollars, which is pretty significant. Um, uh, BN, I'm getting confused between it. Anyway, it's a very, very large number. The point is, the greater they expand it, the less the less that your products and services are going to buy. So it's inflationary in one in one sense. And you speak to most people, they, they see that cost of living between utility items, especially electricity and those types of things, and food items is getting a lot more expensive. European Central Bank, uh, in the UK, same deal. They're printing money to, to be able to uh, keep the economy afloat because much of the economy can completely contract. So gold and silver long term is a great investment. Now, I've got Swiss francs, I've got euros here, I've got US dollars, I've got uh, Durnams um, from the UAE. Primarily when I was taught by my mentor, he said always put about, he said back and then in 2001, put about, that was the beginning of a very strong bull market, maybe three to five percent of your wealth, of your paper wealth is held, held in actually uh, precious metals. Many of the experts today, because of the global conditions we're living in, say maybe 10%. Okay. The great thing is it's highly liquid. So even if you put a bit in and all of a sudden, six months from now, three months from now, two years from now, um, all of a sudden, well, you needed a bit of cash because maybe you need to uh, repair the engine on your car or buy a new car or go on the holiday. You can actually liquidate your gold and silver very, very quick, convert it, convert it back to cash, uh, and that is okay. Okay, but I like to have a long-term view on this. So I think gold and silver long-term is a good, safe holding position uh, and you'll do, people will do very well simply because currencies are going to do bad, to be quite honest. On, on the store asset, well, the store asset is coming into a very exciting phase right now. We did uh, quite a few drillings uh, at the end of last year. We only bought this asset on the 1st of August last year. And since then, of course, we've been uh, putting money into the actual site. This year, of course, we experienced some downside on the oil and gas prices. I mean, oil prices on the futures went below uh, below zero, which had never happened before in history. But fortunately, through the good management of Ryan Messer and the team, we had a hedge uh, in place, which is like an insurance policy. We, we, we had, they had a put uh, in position. Um, so if the oil price dropped below $50, is that... Um, British Petroleum, BP, where the hedge was with, they'd actually have to pay us 50. You know, it went over 50. Uh, we'd have to pay them a call of about three or four dollars, I think it was, per barrel. The good thing is about that, we protected our downside. Now that hedge actually finishes, I believe, at the end of July. So we had it at the most important time in history to have this particular hedge in position. So it protected our revenues on raccoon, uh, raccoon bend. And speaking to Ryan Messer yesterday, he said him and the team are looking at putting some more new hedges in place. Uh, for the further uh, next uh, six months of, of this year, just to protect our investments. Now, we'll start paying out distributions in Q3. Um, what they exactly are per per unit share, I, I can't uh, say that right now, but um, we'll be speaking more about that on the next webcast when Ryan Messer with, is with us. Um, there's different things we have to do, but he'll explain it very, very clearly and be very transparent, but it's a great asset. I mean, I'm a, probably one of the larger investors, uh, owner of store. And I love being involved in it because I just know it's a, it's a, it's a relatively long-term, um, low-risk uh, investment. And why do I say that? Because everything's about risk management, isn't it? I mean, you don't want to put yourselves uh, in more stress financially by betting on, on, the, on a risky asset. 
why it's low risk is that it's been in production for many, many years. It has very, very strong reserves, proven reserves on the balance sheet. We also have other reserves, what they call uh, um, uh, possible and probable, which they call P2 and P3. We have very large reserve holdings there. So there's a lot of upside to the actual asset as well. The ownership of the assets, uh, over 80% of the assets owned by indus industry insiders, such as geologists and, uh, and of course, engineers. I know Sean is on this call. Hi, Sean. He met some. Um, he had the ple Adrian also, Dr. Blue, he also had the pleasure of meeting some of the uh, geologists and engineers at the site down there in, uh, in Houston, which is fantastic. So, we, and these people have been involved with this asset management and ownership since 2001. So, here we have, we have industry experts who manage the site who are also owners. And when you have, and to me as an investor, I think, well, if over 80% of the ownership of this asset is willing to put their money into the game, have skin in the game, I'm willing, to put, I'm willing to put my money in because I'm backing the expertise, aren't I? Same as Ryan Messer and the team. So I like that very, very much. The Catholic Church Scholarship Fund in the US also owns a small percentage and we own about uh, 12%. So that's, uh, that's very exciting. But again, I see this as a, as a long-term as a long -term, um, residual income asset. That's going to be paying out for the next 20, 25 years. Who knows, who knows where oil prices are going to be in, in the next one year, two years, three years, five years, 25 years. But one thing is for sure, renewable energy is the future. That's where we all want to be. But there's no there's no chance that renewable energy uh, is going to be able to expand and keep up with this with the demand uh, that's required uh, around the world. So oil and gas initially is going to be around for the next couple of decades strongly, especially natural gas as well. And we have a great asset there. The uni uniqueness about this particular asset has been proven. That the lifting cost, what I mean by the lifting cost, the operational cost to be able to extract out the hydrocarbons from Mother Earth into the tanks or into the midstream operation is very, very, very low. And I was looking at financials yesterday and I've seen what the uh, the team have done there. They shut off a couple of uh, a, a couple of the wells and different things. They stopped some completions and some of the works to bring down the operational costs significantly while these uh, oil prices have been down in these last months. So we have a great team there. So and I've known this team since 2000, I first met them in 2004, which is uh, pretty amazing. So I invested in the large asset with them back in 2004 in Louisiana, in the Baton Rouge uh, region of the United States. I know Claudia, a couple of years later, she also invested with them. And I think some of the people on this call, uh, parents had also invested uh, with them in 2004, 2005, six, et cetera as well. So we have a long history with this particular group. Good people, great team. And in the end, you're investing with people. So for a simple question, I know I've given you a long answer, but uh, that's why I'm in it, because I believe in it very strongly. Thank you, Bill. No, this was a good, uh, good uh, uh, actually answer, long answer, but good answer, because uh, that's the point, you know. Um, see, uh, we want to have, because we don't know, I mean, like, let's face it, I, I have, I'm not an expert in oil and gas and in sourcing assets, I have no clue. Uh, so you want to have a, a team who has a clue, who has an understanding, but also a team which is themselves invested in. So um, who themselves would actually buy the assets. I remember very vividly in, um, when was it, around uh, uh, 98, <laughs> so before the 2000, uh, you know, 2000, we had this big crash. Um, and um, so basically every hairdresser almost was recommending shares um, uh, from, and so I went, of course, as most people do, because with my ignorance and my not understanding, um, to the bank um, and, um, and of course, I had some cash. I had saved some up some cash and um, and put it into different uh, shares and investments. And so I had no clue. Uh, but because so I went to the bank teller, and the bank teller told me, well, this and this and that. But they did, didn't tell me about the risk. They didn't tell me about I could lose it all. Of course, I lost it all. Um, I lost almost three hundred thousand um, dollars in uh, so so back then. Had no idea. Um, so see because because you don't understand and and so because they tell you and because Dave bank tellers are not invested in so here we have a team which is actually invested in the assets they themselves own it um, and makes all the difference because because they wouldn't go into something which wouldn't work so yeah I, I love the asset and back to your before you we were uh, with a trillion or billions, actually a trillion. So actually, the, the Fed now is putting one trillion per day into the repo market alone. Uh, so just when pandemic started, the Fed actually pumped in 1.75 trillion money coming from Finnair, 
printed, printing press, um, into the markets. And of course, uh, we are now, I think, uh, something like, uh, they're going to look like four trillion, which they could put in the market. I mean, Bill, you made one day, I, I remember that very, very good. You did a explanation, expl excellent explanation on uh, what is what it really means, like uh, a million, what it means a billion and when, what it means a trillion. Yes. Uh, maybe you can one day do this to us as well visually again. It was so nice. Well, basically, well, the thing is, we're, we're talking numbers here. I was actually yeah. speaking to a businessman here today, even about the pandemic. Oh, we see that uh, this country lost 200 people died today and this country lost three people today. We even started to talk about lives like it's a simple number. I mean, isn't it? You really think about it. It's, it's sad, very, very sad in one sense. But let's go back to the monetary system, not talk about people's lives. But on the monetary side of things, you know, a, a, you know, a million dollars, just to give you an idea, we talk about a billionaire or a millionaire or, or even a trillion dollars printed. What does it really mean? That, I mean, when I grew up as a kid, trillions only really relate, related to really the cosmos, stars and planets and those types of things. We never think about that in the monetary system in one sense. But to be, if you had $50,000 income, you had fifty thousand dollars and you saved that for twenty years, you would be a millionaire. So twenty as fifty thousand dollars for twenty years. You religiously saved every year, that's after taxes and everything, of course. Remember that. You'd be a millionaire after twenty years. Now to be a billionaire, you'd have to save for twenty thousand years. Twenty thousand years. And to be a trillionaire, it had to be twenty million years. So when you're speaking about a monetary supply expansion of trillions, uh, we're talking massive amount. Now, since 2008, if you look at the monetary supply charts of actually the EU, even the UK, even Australia, of course, um, and um, the Federal Reserve, I mean, it's like a hockey stick since 2000, the amount of money that was issued in supply. And that's why, that's why uh, you know, much of the inflation has been experienced outside of the US, but that it'll come home. Um, and we're, we're feeling that, but primarily feeling it when it comes to utility costs and food items. But it's also real estate in many places has also gone up uh, tremendously uh, in many countries where when I grew up, if you were 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, that age, many people were getting married back in those days. I'm a bit older than a lot of people on this call. Um, they could still think about and dream about owning a house. Today, people at that age have no chance of owning a house in, my, in most cities in the world. Really, it's just it's it's the price is way out of reach. So we're living in very very different times today, and that's why it's really important to understand how the monetary system actually works, how it how it affects you, how it affects your family. But I like to keep it simple because I was not educated in it either. I had to learn this over many many decades of businesses, and I've been in business since 1986 as a self-employed entrepreneur. Made a lot of mistakes as well, but one thing I know for sure, you build wealth by the ownership of real assets. But at the same time, we need to have a secondary income. It could be Utopian Global. You might have a, you might be a taxi driver, Uber driver. You might be a doc. You might be a lawyer. You might be a plumber. It doesn't really matter. The most important thing is that's your primary source income. Most importantly, when you're when you're asleep, you've got to have money working for you. And that's the ability that you have with Utopian Global through the marketing of our platform, sharing with other people, when people buy our products and services, when they're buying real assets, they're not buying juices and lotion, lotions and potions, they're buying something of real value, you're actually generating income while you're asleep. And that excites me. When I learned that decades ago, I ne it never left my mind. Um, whereas most people, they just trade the time for money. And the other thing, of course, is you have to, have to know that you're actually earning real assets. You said before, Claudia, that you were burnt some years ago I was during the dot-com phase, I think it was the 1990s, many people were. You lost $300,000. First of all, I'd love to congratulate you for having $300,000 back then. That's well done. Hopefully that knowledge has uh, done you well that you won't, that you'll be able to make that many times over. But true, in those days, you didn't have access to information. Like everything's available on our phones today and that's good, but it's also has a dark side as well because much of the stuff that's on there regarding different opportunities and things like that, are they really, are they real? Have you done your due diligence? Do they have real assets? This and that. So you've got to question things. It's really important to question things, okay? And do your due diligence, manage your risk. Uh, but we think we've designed Utopian Global as a low risk um, program for our members around the world. Been doing it for the last 12 years. And we have a great team that we've had uh, involved with us for many, many years as well, such as Ryan Messer. You've been with us, Claudia, for 12 years. It's a long time, huh? 
Um, and Bill, so there's a question coming. Uh, there's a question coming. Sorry to interrupt you um, about, of course, uh, the difference between buying gold from us and buying in a jewelry job uh, as jewelry. That's a great decision. It's a great question. Um, primarily, it's it, it's really the cost. I mean, depending on the culture. For example, here I am in Dubai. Many of the um, the Eastern cultures, Indian, Pakistani cultures. Uh, I mean, Dubai is known for its gold. So when people get married or different things like that, I mean, they're just laced in gold and they'll, they'll hand that gold off to the next generation, to, to the next uh, uh, daughter or whatever it might be. That could be multiple generations. What they're really doing is handing down gold. The difference is, of course, when you buy this gold here that I've got here, um, as, a, as an affiliate member of us, you'll pay about 3% above the spot price for gold. Now, the spot price, I could go into that discussion what that means. Um, but let me keep it very simple. When you're buying gold, you're, you're buying it. Let's say you're buying a thousand dollars worth, a thousand euros worth of gold. Uh, you'll be charged three percent of that, which means you're going to get, you're going to take delivery off, you're going to take uh, into your back office, into your account, 970 euros worth of, of gold, okay, in grams, in one sense. And the other three percent, two percent goes to the company for the expenses, etc., and admin. Uh, fees and 1% goes to the affiliate that introduced you. We pay 1% or whatever the purchase value is. Now, if you were to go and buy, buy a piece of jewelry from a jewelry shop, um, do you know how much, okay, it could be 14 karat gold, 18 karat gold, 24 karat gold. So you have the value of the gold, you know straight away from us it's 3% above spot, very simple. You go and buy a bracelet or a Rolex watch, which is gold. How much of that is actually real gold? How much is that in design? You could be paying 40, 50% of that uh, over, over and above the gold spot price just for the design, probably a lot more than that, actually. For example, a single, a simple uh, gold chain or necklace, uh, most of those would probably have, I can calculate, it depends on the weight, of course. But I know here in Dubai, you you you, you can negotiate. Uh, you have the you have the price of the gold content, then you then you'll negotiate a percentage above that uh, for the design and the manufacturing, and that could be you know 20, 30 percent, just depend on your negotiations. But that's how they do it here. Most jewelers that you walk into into the West, most people are blind. They don't know that. They just see the retail price. They have no idea what the gold content is, and they'll end up actually buying it. I remember even gold medals for Olympians. They have something like two percent gold in them. And I remember being on stage with Bob Proctor in, in Los Angeles, and there was a man there that won one of those, I think it's called an Oscar, correct? From Hollywood. Yeah, Oscar, yeah. Hollywood, yeah. He's standing there holding a big Oscar, and uh, it weighed about 10 kilos. It was pretty heavy, this thing, actually. And uh, Bob, there's about, I don't know, must have been a thousand people in the room. Bob called me up, so I'm on stage with him, and he said, Tell me about this gold, Bill. You, you know a bit about gold. I said, Well, I didn't want to offend the man that won the Oscar. Um, I said, Well, Bob, this weighs about, let's say it's 12 kilos. A good delivery bar of gold weighs about 12 kilos, but a good delivery bar of gold is about a half million dollars. Your Oscar here is probably $400. And of course, he looked at me, and the guy that won the Oscar looked at me as well um, because it was gold plated. It was just, it was a steel. It's zinc, I think it was, and it's just, it's just, it's just gold plated. So you have to know gold plated uh, is very, very cheap to do. In fact, you can buy gold plating solution about um, $50. And that would probably gold plate you one square meter uh, of, of metal in one sense. It's very, very high margin. So anyway, this is just a, to answer the question. It's all about the production cost, design cost, etc. So our gold is very, very, very efficient when it comes to buying. And also, it's also liquid. You, you can sell it back. It's, it's money. It's money in your bank in one sense. You can convert it back to cash very easily. That, and that, that's a good answer, Bill. And there's another question coming here before we close out. I know we're almost on the hour. Uh, what would be the best strategy for someone to join that doesn't have a lot of money to start? Get get started. Now let me let me answer that. If you procrastinate, it's like you know when's the best time to plant a tree? Twenty years ago, of course. When's the next best best time? Right now. If you don't make if you don't make action in your life, if you don't plan and work the plan, you're going to be in the same situation 12 months from now, two years from now, three years from now. You've got to dig in. You've got to make a plan. I believe everybody. You don't need a lot of money for this. I don't know what country you're in, but for less than two dollars a day, you own a global business, and a percentage of that is actually assets. That's all it's costing. Introduce three people. 
of any pack in the in the lower packages, you've already got your money back. So the asset's actually free. Sharing it with three people. Work with a team as Claudia teaches people, build an organization. You have seven or eight people in your organization, anywhere in your first two levels, you're already cash flow positive, you've already got your assets for free. What other opportunity in this world that is real and sustainable can give you that? Certainly driving Uber won't set you free. It'll pay the bills and contribute to your life, which is absolutely fantastic. I see the greatness that it does in this part of the world. It's absolutely great. I see what it does uh, in other countries like Kenya and also um, Uganda that have been to people drive Uber. Fantastic. It's given them another source of income, but it won't set you free. So the most important thing is if you haven't got, you don't have a high income or, or a lot of money, we are perfect for you. Because yeah. what else are you going to do? What else are you going to do? The most important thing is, is to educate yourself, get trained, get programmed, get into the program in our back office. I think it's there. You were born rich by Bob Proctor. If you haven't got it, email support and we'll send you the program. Go through that. In fact, I just sent this program to someone in Uganda the other day. They said, it's changing my life. You'll change your life by changing how you think. Get disciplined, get engaged with a real team. There's no judgment here. And if you want to change your life, you've got to decide to do that and no one else. And we have a facility here that if you understand it and work, it, it takes time. It could certainly, it's low risk. It could certainly financially reward you. And um, you can turn, you can turn the 99 euros. I think you said you spoke about Pastor Eddie from, from Kenya. He, he invested his night. He didn't pay his rent. He didn't pay his rent from Uganda. Sorry. He didn't pay his rent. He put the 99 euros in and bought his first package in the first, I think it was 12 weeks or maybe 10 weeks. He earned three and a half thousand euros. Mm -hmm. Turned it around completely. Now we have, now he has an office uh, in Uganda. I mean, they're not doing it easy there. It's a tough, it's tough there because of the pandemic, et cetera. Things are shut down. People can't do businesses. It's it's not easy. But this vehicle here, here we are. We're doing business meetings now. People all over the world, we're communicating, talking to each other, and we're doing it for the comfort of our own home. Fantastic. So my answer to you is I get really excited when people ask me these questions. You've got to make a decision. You've got to train yourself. You've got to get real knowledge, get engaged with real people. Now, for the people in the US, we also have Dr. Blue. And Pastor Lachelle Blue are coming up with a fantastic product that's uh, going to generate, going to generate strong cash flow because we can't use store in the U.S. But we have another, we have another product. It's sort of along the lines of financial product. It's really going to benefit people in that region. It's going to increase your income. I'm not going to tell you what it is right now. Still some time away, but it's been engineered as we speak right now. There's a lot of research being put into this by Dr. Blue. Uh, a lot of work gone into it. So we have different programs coming up. The whole idea that we make these programs available to all people around the world, the whole simple idea of trying to make your life better, be able to reduce your debt by having another source of income and getting ownership of real assets and understanding that the monetary system is unfair. It's unjust. It's designed to transfer wealth away from you back to the central banking system. And once you get that, you realize you can't do just the norm. Because if you do just the norm, you're never going to be financially free. I just gave you the examples before of the housing prices in Britain in 1971, or London, I should say, and in the US in 1971 compared to, to uh, 2020, and how much money, paper money, you'd need by then compared to now. But if you had have saved and had some a gold savings program, you wouldn't have been affected by it. In fact, you'd be way in the US, you'd be way in front many times over. So this is why the knowledge of understanding money is really important because we're not taught about it. I wasn't taught about it. That's something I've had to learn and it cost me a lot to make this experience. So I'm passionate about what we do. We have a good team, good leadership. It's not a quick rich program, but I do tell you the fast track commissions, if, you're, if, you're, if, you're, if you learn how to present this, learn what we have, you present it to people, don't push it upon them, just share it with them, get them to understand what you have and they buy, in, buy into, into, our, into our, what we're doing to get the ownership of assets and preserve a bit of their wealth, you're going to in, earn instant commissions. Bam, you'll see it straight in your back office. We pay out weekly on the fast track. And we pay out monthly on the unit levels. Uh, we pay into your nominated bank account or we pay into your Bitcoin account. Very simple. And we do this globally. Very good, uh, Bill. No, uh, definitely very, very good. In fact, I mean, as uh, you sometimes quote it as well, and I really 
uh, this stuck with me as uh, Eric Hoffer, the great philosopher, said, in a time of drastic change, it is the learners who inherited the future. And the learned usually find themselves equipped to live in a world that no longer exists. So very, very profound. Most people don't understand it. The learned usually find themselves equipped to live in a world that no longer exists. Uh, so you've got to make action. That is all what this quote says. In times of drastic change, it is the learners who inherited the future. Um, the future is here, but you got to make a action step. You got to make that decision. Uh, so with that, I'm going to say thank you to everybody. I know Sahia has still a question about the minerals um, and the mineral mining. I suggest next week uh, you come on the call. Uh, we're going to have a great call with Ryan Messer, uh, with uh, the uh, CEO, of course, of Store, talking more about, uh, of course, the project. And it's going to be exciting and it's going to be great. And um, ending up this presentation as well tonight at 9 Eastern Standard Time. I'm not sure how much, what time it is in Australia, but 9 Eastern Standard Time. Uh, that is 3 a.m. here for me in Germany. It's 2 a.m. for the UK people, so you guys are asleep. Um, but uh, 9 uh, p.m., uh, Dr. Blue uh, tonight is going to do um, a training and some testimonies. So get on these calls, bring people on these calls, because again, it is your future. So with that, thank you guys and have a great evening. And thank you, Bill. Really, really great call, great information. Thank you, Claudia. And yes, do get on the call of Dr. Blue. Dr. Blue has been a friend and the client for ours and his family for over 10 years, maybe 12 years now. Okay, fantastic. And he will teach you so much. He gives these people great support. So be engaged with him. And remember, you've got to make the decision. The best time to plant a tree is 20 years ago. The next best time is right now. You want to plant your wealth tree, plant the seeds, let it grow, harvest it, nurture it, I should say. And over time, it will build up and you have a great team and support here for you. So thanks, everyone. It's a real pleasure to be here. And I look forward to being on the next UK call with Zaheer and uh, Sean and uh, Shaquille, et cetera, next week, too, if they're around. I'll be in Dubai, but um, it's always great to catch up with that group there. Okay, thank you, Claudia. Thanks, thank everyone. Thank you. Inshallah.